Hello dear students of Tether Prep Science. Let's go to start the second episode of our revision about all the points in our syllabus as we have different types of questions of Tether Prep Science. Uh, today we have a model exam. How can we answer the different types of questions as we have choose, complete the uh, following statements, give reason for, what happens when, and some types of problems about Unit 1, Unit 2, and Unit 3. So let's go to start our episode today with the first type of questions as we have choose the correct answer from the following uh, words. Uh, question number one, choose the correct answer. Okay? The measuring unit of absorbance radiation or radiation absorbance law is rem, joule, ohm, or ampere. So here we have the measuring unit of absorbance radiation or radiation absorbance is rem. And we can't expose more than 5 rem daily. Next question is tall stem in pea plants is from what traits? Tall stem in pea plants is from what traits? Dominant, recessive, complementary, or all the previous? As we have here, four choices. We should choose only one as we have, we talk about the tall stem as we have the dominant trait. Next question is number three. The red mercury oxide decomposing by heat or by heating into what? Mercury or oxygen or mercury oxide or A and B. We have, as we uh, studied before, mercury oxide, its color is red, 2Mg. O, its color is what? Is red by heating. Change into what and what? Into 2Mg as mercury plus oxygen gas evolves. So here we have two results here as we have mercury and at the same time we have oxygen. So the answer is what here? We will choose A and B because we have mercury and oxygen from the resultants. Fourth question is is a substance which speed up the chemical reaction without being changed. Yani substance speed up or change the speed of chemical reaction. Yani بتغير سرعة تفاعل كيميائي without being changed من غير ما هيتغير. So here we have number A vitamin, number B catalyst, number three or number C carotene or number D no correct answer. يعني فيش ولا واحدة صح. We know substance which speed up the chemical reaction yani bitsarra reaction so here we have a catalyst we have a catalyst number or next question be only what happens when lamma ili yahsal yani increasing the temperature of reactants concerning the speed of reaction ili yahsal if we increase the temperature of the reactants concerning يعني بالنسبة لي the speed of reaction here we have what the speed of reaction increase or decrease or uh, stay as it is طبعا here we have only one answer as we have the speed of reaction well increase because the number of collisions between molecules increase so here we have what happens and we can answer as why and we know the speed of reaction will increase 
Why? Because the number of collisions, collisions معناها الصدمات, between the molecules will increase. Next question is, man exposed to a large dosage of radiation for a short period of time. خلي بالنا we answer here what, what happens when. So here in this question we have man exposed to large dosage جرعة ضخمة أو كبيرة of radiation but for a short period of time لوقت صغير. Here we have some symptoms بعض الأعراض طبعا we have nausea vertigo diarrhea طبعا due to damage in spleen nervous system and digestive system so answer uh, here is uh, the uh, symptoms الاعراض as a nausea vert vertigo diarrhea طبعا as we have the reasons here due to damage in the spleen nervous system and the digestive system next question is what happens if adding a piece of aluminum or aluminium to a hydrochloric acid solution what happens we can answer by using the chemical equation ممكن نستخدم chemical equation to answer this question as we have here adding a piece of aluminum so here we have Al plus HCl okay here we put two here we put six as we have in the answer aluminium more active than hydrogen so we have two Al Cl3 why because we have six uh, uh, chlorine atoms and 2 times 3 equals 6 as we know the chemical equation should be balanced should be balanced لازم تبقى موزونة ok plus what plus here we have 6 chlorine and we have 6 hydrogen so we have 3 H2 as hydrogen gas evolves so uh, this answer not enough we should answer by using the uh, words or the names with colors if possible so we have to write here aluminium plus hydrochloric acid Producing as aluminium chloride, and here we have hydrogen as effervescence. Effervescence, effervescence, which means fawaran. So here we have to answer as we uh, focusing about hydrogen in this chemical equation. نخلي بالنا لانه sometimes as a give reason for يقول لي appearance of effervescence on adding a piece of aluminium to hydrochloric acid so we know now the products here is aluminium chloride and hydrogen gas as effervescence question number four what happens when increasing the conductor length concerning the electrical resistance value so we talk about the increasing إن أنا بزود the length of conductor بزود طول 
السلك لينث اوف كوندكتور كونسيرنينج ذا الكتريك الكتريكال ريزيستنس فاليو لو انا عندي زودت اللينث اوف كوندكتور اور ذا لينث اوف ذا الكتريك واير لو زودت طول السلك وات هابنز تو ذا الكتريك ريزيستنس وي نو ذا ريليشن بتوين ذا لينث اوف كوندكتور اند ذا الكتريك ريزيستنس از ان دايركتلي بروبورشنال ويتش مينز وين ذا لينث اوف ذا الكتريك واير انكريز ذا الكتريك ريزيستنس انكريز سو هير وي انسر ذا electric resistance will increase so here dear students زي ما احنا شايفين كده او زي ما احنا اتكلمنا مع بعض في ال points as a choose or what happens when The first type of questions is choose. We have to uh, focus about uh, one word in the question to pick up the answer from this uh, type or from the question. As what happens when? We should know the uh, circumstances or the tawab of the uh, uh, factor here or the action in each type of question or in each question. As we have. what happens and sometimes what happens and and why so we ha we should know uh, why this action takes place and why يعني عارفين ليه because this question maybe as a give reason for يعني ممكن يبقى give reason for not what happens as choose complete right wrong correct underlined and so on لازم نبقى فاكرين كده كويس ان uh, ال question ممكن uh, coming in any uh, form في اي شكل من الاشكال Let's go to complete with the next type of questions. As here we have, زي ما احنا شايفين قدامنا كده, problem. By using three electric cells, we should remember we have here three electric cells. Each one has electromotive force equal 1.5 volts. Illustrate by drawing. بيقولي اشرح بالرسم. How can we obtain Electromotive force equal number A 4.5 number uh, volts taban number uh, B is 3 volts. As we have to illustrate by drawing, as we should answer by using the uh, electric cells drawing. Taban we have how many cells? We have three electric cells. And each one of them has electromotive force equal 1.5 volts. How can we connect them? Zaha salhum to uh, obtain three uh, 4.5 volts or 3 volts. Taban 4.5 volts as a maximum. As a maximum electro electromotive force of the uh, dry cell or the battery. So we have all the electric cells are connected in series connection. As we, as you see in front of you, زي ما احنا شايفين قدامنا كده, we have three cells. We connect them in series connection. Don't forget to write positive and negative poles of the each electric cell, زي ما احنا شايفين قدامنا. So we have positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, and negative. Here we have electromotive force equal what? E M F equal 4.5 volts. And we know why? Because in the series connection is E1 times number of the electric cells. As we have 1.5 times 3 equal 4.5 volts. Okay. Next one is how can we obtain three volts from the three electric cells? Khalibana, we have here three electric cells. We should use the three electric cells in each step. How can we connect them? So here we have as two parallel equal how many? Equal 1.5. 
because in the parallel connection the electromotive force of the battery equal the electromotive force of one cell beside it we have one in series equal 1.5 so in this case we obtain what we obtain three volts as we have positive positive negative negative and here we have positive here we have negative so emf in the second case equal three volts why because these electric cells equal what equal 1.5 plus 1.5 equal what equal three volts next question is correct the underlined words نصلح الغلط بيقولي double substitution reactions depend on the exchanging between molecules to form a new compound يبقى هل double substitution reactions depend on the exchanging between molecules to form a new compounds طبعا here we have a mistake as what as we talk about exchange between molecules is not a right answer as we have to answer exchange between ions for example now خدنا مع بعض example as uh, we have uh, here chemical equation between uh, Na as sodium nitrate or uh, sodium chloride نخليها sodium chloride with silver nitrate we have here positive ion negative ion positive ion negative ion as we have positive with negative and positive with negative so we have here the answer is sodium nitrate and silver chloride as we start with positive end with negative start with positive and end with negative as double substitution reaction double substitution reaction as exchange between ions to form a new compounds as here we have زي ما احنا شايفين depends on exchanging between ions next question is why the eyes are from the recessive traits in the human race we talk about the middle east, east uh, area منطقة الشرق الأوسط هنا we talk about why the eyes are from the recessive traits in the human race طبعا we know why the eyes is from what not from the recessive traits are from what are from the dominant traits dominant traits narrow eyes are from the recessive traits number three dna consists of a small units called enzymes dna consists of a small units called enzymes طبعاً we know DNA consists of small units are called nucleotides so we know now DNA consists of a small units are called nucleotides direct current has variable current intensity and direction so <clears throat> we should differentiate between direct current as DC and alternating current as AC we know direct current has what not variable current intensity and direction the direct current has constant يعني ثابت constant intensity and direction while alternating current has variable intensity and direction so we prefer to use alternating current than direct current as I give reason for 
here we have compare between ionic compounds and covalent compounds according to their speed in chemical reaction we have ionic compounds and we have covalent compounds which one will react faster than the other in the chemical reaction we remember the ionic compound react faster than covalent compounds because the reaction between ions faster the reaction or than the reaction between molecules so here we answer why I'll look upon it compare here according to the speed of chemical reaction how look ionic compounds react fast طبعا لان هنا بتوين براكتس كده اكتب له بتوين ions while covalent compounds react slow Taban between or the reaction between molecules as I give reason for now only give reason for muscle and well the ionic compound react faster than covalent compound which react slower than ionic compound all because the ionic compound the reaction between ions while in covalent compounds the reaction uh, between molecules here we compare uh, between the dominant and the recessive hereditary traits according to their appearance in the first generation as we know from the first and the second Mendel's law we have first law is called the law of segregation and the second law is called the law of independent assortment we know the uh, ratio or the percentage of the dominant trait and what and the recessive trait in what in the first generation or F1 so we have dominant trait how do you dominant trait okay appears completely in first generation as hundred percent while the recessive traits disappears completely in first generation as zero percent so we know the difference in the first generation as dominant rate appears completely as 100% in the first generation we talk about the first generation while the recessive traits disappears completely in the first generation as 0% so here we uh, uh, compare between dominant and recessive traits according to their appearance in the first generation here we have a problem we only calculate the electric resistance of a conductor when the quantity of electric charge passing in 50 uh, uh, 50 columns by working done equal 20 joules in two seconds and then uh, we have some given as we have number one we have the quantity of electric charge equal 50 columns and we have working done equal 20 joules and the time here equal what equal two seconds so we want to calculate the electric resistance as we have unknown quantity here as we have no r 
but we have Q as a quantity of a charge and we have uh, uh, W as working done as we have at the same time we have T as a time from the mathematical relation or the mathematical law we have to know here from the magic triangle زي ما احنا خدنا قبل كده we have R equal what we know R equal V over I so we should calculate the potential difference and we should calculate the uh, electric current intensity how we calculate the electric current intensity or potential difference we know here V equal what equal W over Q work done to uh, transfer quantity of a charge and we know at the same time I equal Q over T so we should calculate V and I to find R as we have V equal W equal what equal 20 over Q Q equal 50 here a moguda for 50 columns tamam and work done equal uh, 20 joules so by using calculator as we have 20 over 50 equal what equal 0 0.4 0 0.4 what hmm. volts don't forget to write the measuring units beside the value as we have to calculate at the same time here I as we know I equal Q over T quantity of a charge equal 50 and time equal 2 seconds so 50 over 2 equal 25 what 25 amperes because we know the measuring unit of the electric current intensity is ampere now it's easy to calculate R because we know R equal hmm, R equal V over I as we have 0 0.4 over 25 equal what by using calculator bardo 0 0.4 over 25 equal 0 0.016 يبقى هكتب الانسر بتاعتي 0 0.016 16 watt ohm don't forget to write the measuring unit beside the value as we see in this problem as you see here the, uh, dear students in this problem زي ما احنا شفنا كده في المسألة اللي قدامنا uh, we have to use the three uh, mathematical laws as we have first one to calculate the electric current intensity and the second one to calculate the potential difference as we know the potential difference and the electric current intensity we can calculate R because R is the electric resistance is the ratio between the potential difference and the current intensity as the definition of electric resistance by using Ohm's law يبقى احنا عرفنا ان some types of problems we have to use more than one triangle or more than uh, one mathematical law Okay, uh, next question or next type of questions as we see here زي ما احنا هنشوف قدامنا دلوقتي We only write the scientific term It is a part of DNA exists on the chromosome and control the hereditary traits هو جزء أو part of DNA exists on the chromosome and control the hereditary traits طبعا we know what yes is gene gene is a part of DNA and control the hereditary traits هو اللي بيتحكم في الصفة الوراثية اللي هو الجين وهو part of DNA موجود exists on the chromosome number two it is the arranging of metals in descending order according to their chemical activity this question we studied before in second prep and now we studied again in third prep. خدناه قبل كده في تاني عدادي ومناخده تاني في تالت عدادي. Arranging of metals in descending order according to their chemical activity. 
طبعا هنا we have what we have chemical chemical activity series chemical activity series or C A S as you like chemical activity series or C A S as the arranging of metals in descending order according to their chemical activity next question as number three here it is the potential difference between two poles of a battery when the electric circuit is opened again it is the potential difference but between خلي بالنا between two poles of a battery امتى when the electric circuit is opened so here we talk about another quantity as what yes as we talk about the electro motive force as the electromotive force is the potential difference but between two poles of the battery or the electric dry cell في شرط when the electric circuit is opened no electric current كلمة opened هنا يعني turn off يعني مطفية opened يعني no connection يعني مفتوحة as a opened bridge كبري مفتوح يعني we can't uh, move on it Uh, next question is complete we have complete the following statements as we have mg plus cuso4 forming what plus what we know according to the chemical activity series this reaction is called simple substitution reaction as more active metal replaces the less the uh, least active metal so magnesium can replace copper so we have here mg so4 as a magnesium sulfate plus cu as a copper and we know copper is reddish brown or brownish red or red precipitate يعني راسب لونه بني او طوبي او احمر اللي هو النحاس اللي هو كوبر and this reaction is called simple substitution reaction Okay, next question is, is a map contains all human chromosomes? Is a map contains all human chromosomes? طبعا هنا, we have as a question from lesson 2, unit what? Unit 3, we talk about here genome. As genome is a map, خريطة. contains all human chromosomes next one as number three device used to control the potential difference and the current intensity control what v potential difference and the current intensity i and we know v over i equal what equal r and this device is called what yes is called rheostat rheostat and we, we know rheostat is uh, used to control the potential difference and the current intensity by changing the length of the wire next question is 2NaNO3 as we know sodium nitrate Here we have heating as thermal decomposition reaction. What happens in this case? We know sodium is a monster. Wash. Take all the atoms and left only one oxygen molecule. As we have 2NaNO2. Here we have NO3 plus O2. oxygen gas evolves as thermal decomposition reaction if you want to calculate لو عايزين نحسب we have two sodium and we have two nitrogen 
and we have six oxygen two times three equals six here we have two sodium we have two nitrogen and we have four oxygen plus two oxygen here so we have six oxygen atoms so the chemical equation is balanced لازم تبقى بالانس احنا في تالتة اعدادي لازم نفتكر ان الكيميكال اكويجن شود بي بالانس اوكي هير وي هاف ا بروبلم بيقول لي الستريت ذا ريزلت اوف اون ا جينيتيك بيزس باي كروسنج تو بي بلانتس وان هاز هايبريد يلو سيدز وذ انذر هاز جرين سيد طيب فروم ذا تيبل وي نو يلو سيد in pea plant is dominant trait and we know dominant trait is uh, uh, is uh, uh, symbolized by using capital letter okay but this uh, yellow seed is hybrid yani not pure hagin so we have what y capital y small with another has green seed green is a recessive green seed is a recessive and we know recessive trait appears if the gene is pure only and we have to symbolize by using a small letter of the dominant طبعا الدومينانت واي كابيتال يبقى هنا واي سمول واي سمول طيب we have three steps as we have parents We have gametes, and we have F1 as first generation. Here we have Y capital, Y small, with Y small, Y small. By the law of segregation, we have here Y capital, Y small, with Y small. Y small as each one of them in a circle Y capital Y small Y small Y small so by distribution here Y capital Y small then Y capital with second Y small then here we have Y small with the first Y small and then the last one is y small with the second y small as we have at the last step y capital y small y capital y small then y small y small and y small y small so how many has yellow seeds here we have yellow seeds And here we have green seed. So the percentage is what is 50% to 50% as here we have two green seeds with two yellow seeds يعني النص بالنص or ratio one to one or as a percentage 50 50 okay uh, in this problem dear students في المسألة دي we have two uh, individuals but not pure يعني one of them is hybrid and the other is pure خلي بالنا this problem not like the first law or the second law of Mendel as we have in the first law and in the second law of Mendel we have two individuals are contrasts and the pure here the two individuals are uh, the two individuals are contrast but not pure one of them is pure as a recessive and the recessive traits appear if the gene is pure only يعني لما يقول لي green seed اكيد y small y small لما يقول لي short stem t small t small if we have yellow seed we should know if this yellow seed is is uh, uh, pure or hybrid if we have tall stem we should know this uh, trait is pure or hybrid and so on يبقى خلي بالنا ان هنا the ratio is 50 50 because the two traits or the two individuals not both or both 
not pure one is pure and one is hybrid next question dear students is لما نشوف مع بعض كده بيقول لي give reason for appearance of a black precipitate on heating a green copper carbonate appearance of a black precipitate on heating a green copper sulfate so we talk about um, thermal decomposition reaction يبقى we have to answer by using the chemical reaction or the chemical equation as we have copper carbonate Cu CO3 by heating we know copper not a monster like sodium هياخد just oxygen atom and left the rest parts as we have here CuO copper oxide plus CO2 as a carbon dioxide so we have copper carbonate green producing copper oxide black plus carbon dioxide and we know carbon dioxide is what uh, turns the litmus or uh, uh, lime uh, water sorry uh, from clear to turbid or milky as we studied before in uh, prep sta uh, 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 primary stage زي ما خدنا في ابتدائي قبل كده الكربون دايكسيد تشينج لتمس اور لايم ووتر انتو ميلكي اور تربت هير وي هاف جيف ريزن فور يوزنج زنك تيرنينجز اور باودر ديورينج ذا جيف ريزن طبعا ديورينج ذا هيدروجينيشن اور هيدريتينج اوف اويل اللي هي بيسموه الهدرجه بالعربي ليه وي يوز زنك تيرنينجز اور باودر The key of the answer, مفتاح الإجابة, from turnings or powder. يعني هنا إحنا هنستخدم كلمة turning or powder. Why? Because if we talk about turnings or powder, we talk about what? We talk about surface area. So the answer بتاعتي أقول له to increase the surface. area to speed up the reaction عشان ازود سرعة الreaction okay dear students by this question we will stop this episode now and we will complete next week inshallah I hope you get more benefits from these uh, questions. Thank you. See you. Goodbye.